I'm sorry I can't be with you at Student Pride, but I did want to send you this message. First of all, congratulations on what you're doing. It's an incredibly important initiative. Secondly, this year marks 25 years since Section 28 was passed by Mrs Thatcher's government, one of the most homophobic laws in our country's history. And you know, we've made such progress since then. Getting rid of Section 28, equalising the age of consent, introducing new rules on adoption by gay and lesbian couples, and also introducing laws to prevent discrimination against gay people in daily life. But we've got further to go. I was proud to lead the vast majority of Labour MPs through the division lobbies to vote for equal marriage recently, and we must make sure we get the bill through. And you know, I had an incredibly moving letter recently from a young man who wrote to me uh, and who said, please, please vote for equal marriage. He said, I am Catholic, but I'm also gay, and I believe that I should be able to marry the person I love. Well, I agree with him, and that's why I was voting for equal marriage, and that's why I hope it will get on the statute book as soon as possible. But we know there's further to go, further to go to counteract homophobic bullying, further to go to campaign and use the position we've built up in Britain to campaign against discrimination against gay people and lesbians all around the world. So there's so much more to do. Congratulations to you uh, on Student Pride. It's an incredibly important event. I'm fully in support of what you're doing. And together, let's make our country the most equal, the most fair in the world.